Hi, it's Cameron with SMB, and today I'm showing you our 35 gallon water tank. Uh, this is a wheel well water tank, part number 10 3008. Today we're showing you installed on a 148 Transit. It also fits the, the Sprinter. Um, to start, we'll show you some of the dimensions on the tank, the height of the tank. is 15 and 3 quarters. The width of the tank is also 15 and 3 quarters. And the length of the tank is 46 and 3 quarters. You'll see the tank goes around the wheel well. Again, for driver and the passenger side, the distance in front and rear is the same. There is more space on the transit wheel wells, so the tank can be slid forward to rearward about two inches. It comes with brand new straps. And you'll see in a situation like this where there's a gap in the strap, we like using this uh, pre-punch. So there's just a Home Depot 3H pre-punch. There's, um, there's already a welded on nut here, so it works perfectly where you could just use the wel current welded on nuts then just put a new 3 8 inch bolt here. The bolts that we provide work well in a situation where that you're going straight into the body here or down here um, into the floor. These are M10 bolts and these are the included plus nuts. This is the included plus nut tool. And then after you drill your hole for the plus nut, you'll put your plus nut in, you'll put your plus nut tool in on top of it. The longer bolt will throw it all the way in. You'll hold it with the tool with an open end wrench. You'll tighten up the bolt until the plus nut spreads. You'll back out the bolt. Then you'll install one of the shorter included M10 bolts right in place. Um, a couple other dimensions to go over before and um, specs to go before we go over to, to the driver's side is the distance to the rear body is seven and a quarter, but again, remember it can be shifted forward about an inch. Uh, we have a half inch fitting on the bottom, half inch fitting on top, then inch and a half on each corner. And we also have an inch and a half fitting on the top. This works perfect for a level sensor. Um, if you, you can also go with your externally mounted level sensors. If you're gonna do a screw in style, if you're gonna do a tape on style. But right here, this is a 15 inch, um, level sensor it's a uh, the part number is su s5u15 um, it's made by kus so again this 15 inches and it's perfect from the bottom and um, the same fittings that we have on this side are also on the front so if you want to have your feed rather than having your feed come all the way here and route up to the front you can have your feed right at the front if that's where your pump is um, I think that's just about it for these, these dimensions and on this side of the tank. Now we'll get this flipped over to the driver's side and show you what that looks like. So now we're on the uh, driver's side here. Um, again, for the straps, these both fall in the pockets. So again, something like this pre-punch. This is a 36 inch long, uh, 3 8 inch pre-punch. It just works out perfectly if you can just punch in three extra holes here and then mount your straps. I would, you know, shift it to make sure a hole is lining up with the straps before you, you drill your anchor points. And again, the spacing off the rear of the van on this side, it's right at seven and a half. Um, this is kind of what we recommend. We don't sell these, these hoses or these lines, but a nice gravity. Um, gravity fill option like this that has the it has an inch and a quarter barb on this side as well as a half inch for the vent this mounts mounts nicely flush with your cabinet here then you can run a uh, inch and a half to inch and a quarter barb here then you can also run your inch and a half to or sorry your half inch to half inch barb here and just push on with the hose clamp and works perfectly. Uh, let us know if you have any questions with this tank or the install, or if there's any other tanks that you're looking for your build, 
We do have quite a few different versions and heights and sizes, and we'd love to be a part of your build. Thank you.